Taylor Swift returned to New York City after performing three sold-out shows in Buenos Aires, Argentina over the weekend, with boyfriend Travis Kelsey present for one of them. The Cruel Summer singer's Black Range Rover was photographed pulling into her Lux Tribeca apartment Monday morning. While Swift couldn't be seen in the heavily tinted SUV, she left Argentina late last night after finishing her third show in the capital city, which had to be rescheduled from Friday due to heavy rainfall. In fact, the singer went straight from her final performance to the airport, arriving in her blue sequin outfit. Although Swift tried to conceal herself under an umbrella, she was hard to miss in the sparkling Oscar de la Renta bodysuit and matching garter. Meanwhile, Kelsey flew out of South America on Sunday afternoon to make it back in time for football practice. The hunky Kansas City Chiefs player was spotted boarding a private plane wearing a beige sweatsuit and a backward green baseball cap. He arrived in the country on Friday after attending teammate Patrick Mahomes' charity gala the night prior. Kelsey was able to land in Argentina before the storm got too bad allowing him and Swift to go out to dinner in lieu of her cancelled concert. The duo, who was first linked in September, was joined by the singer's father, Scott Swift, who appears to have given Kelsey his stamp of approval. The two men were spotted chatting and laughing in the VIP tent Saturday night, with the former stockbroker even wearing a Chief's lanyard. Towards the end of the show, the anti-hero, Singer gave Kelsey a sweet shout-out during her performance of Karma, catching both the football player and her dad by surprise. While Taylor typically sings, Karma is the guy on the screen, coming straight home to me, she swapped, guy on the screen, for, guy on the Chiefs. At the change, Scott immediately turned to Kelsey and patted him on the shoulder as the NFL player buried his head in his hands. Kelsey, who couldn't help but blush, then danced and sang along to the song. After the three-hour show ended, the 12-time Grammy winner and the two-time Super Bowl champion were then seen sharing a passionate kiss backstage, 